What's up, y'all? Golden boy in the house. I'm getting golden out here. <laughs> but uh, today I want to talk about uh, a subscriber um, commented saying how not to buy stuff when like you're feeling down, stuff to make you happy. And trust me, I've struggled with this too. You know, I'm down. Um, I'm like, oh, let me go buy this new pair of shoes when in reality, I can't really afford it. I got bills to pay. And, um, thank you. Anyways, I don't know if you guys heard that. My GPS is running in the background. And yes, I'm still recording on my freaking phone because I haven't had the time to get my, get my laptop fixed. But anyways, back on subject. You know, I, you know, if you've been following me for a while, I get off subject sometimes. Um, yeah, like, you buy a pair of shoes thinking, oh, I can... I can um I can get this right now, you know, even though you can't afford it, you got bills due. Um I'm I was, you know, the king of this. Uh I had hella bills, I was in debt, you know. Um I'd be buying new shoes, new clothes, um, just to fill the void of being unhappy with my life. And um this kind of relates to my saving money videos. But I had to get a hold on this because it wasn't doing nothing for me. Like, you think that thing is going to really make you happy. That materialistic thing is really going to make you happy. But after you buy it, the novelty of it just wears off, you know. It's just like, um, you're like, damn, why did I spend that money when I could have paid this bill? Or I could have just, you know, basically stacked this up. And we all go through the, like, we have these emotions thinking, like, this stuff is really gonna make me happy once I buy it. I buy in so much stuff, you know, shoes, clothes, um, just miscellaneous stuff. And this is what I was, like, going through. Like, when I was, yesterday, when I was moving, I was packing up all my stuff and um, pretty much pretty much getting rid of as much stuff as possible and you don't realize how much shit you have really until you actually pack up and move somewhere else you know it's like why do I got all this shit I was finding shit that I haven't used in years it's like why do I got it why am I using it why do I still hold on to this clothes that are literally collecting well I wouldn't say literally but collecting dust in the in the closet you know that I never wear you know it's just like why yesterday i had a pair of shoes two pairs of shoes that i found in my trunk that i never wear you know i haven't worn years there was a homeless guy by me not trying to brag or anything but he came up to me you know he was i think he was a crackhead but uh i gave him the shoes i said what size shoe you wear it wasn't his size it was a size down but i said look you can sell them or something you know do whatever and i gave it to him you know it's just like uh you gotta declutter your life that's why I said in my video where I was just like, less stuff is more. When you have all this stuff holding you down and you're buying all this stuff to like fix your problems, it doesn't really fix your problems. It just makes you feel good in the moment. I'll give you another example. I like, I'm giving an example, example time, you know? Um, I did a lot of work to my car, you know? Um, not just the engine, but like, um, you know, I, I painted it, uh, I got some new rims, got some new headlights, and in the moment, it made me feel really good. I was like, yeah, yeah, this is dope. But then after that, it was just like, eh, eh, eh. And I had to think, like, did I really need to spend that money on that when I could have just stacked my money, you know? Because it was really expensive to do the things I did, and I just did it. It was out of impulse. You gotta not listen to these impulses in your head and have the self-discipline to stop yourself from doing this because if you keep doing like living your life that way you're gonna end up with a lot of debt and a lot of materialistic things that won't better you in life um it's okay to splurge on yourself occasionally but if you can't afford it you're in debt and you think it's just gonna make you happy or something it's really not trust me i've, I've wasted so much money over the years doing this